Welcome to the series of How To. Hello guys. Welcome to this uh, video tutorial of uh, how to draw using PowerPoint. Um, so, so yeah, as you see here, right? So what's the big deal with PowerPoint? Uh, is this something uh, which you can use it extensively for drawing painting or so uh, because like people mostly think that the PowerPoint is just like an uh, office tool uh, which is used mostly for uh, presentations okay so maybe uh, uh, it's not used for uh, paintings okay uh, or even drawing any character or clip art or something like that okay so but uh, that's uh, that assumption is totally wrong you can actually do magic with the PowerPoint and uh, I'm going to tell you uh, I'm, in fact I'm going to teach you uh, different uh, uh, things in this like uh, how you can uh, draw uh, good nice uh, brilliant characters using uh, uh, PowerPoint okay uh, so so if you still don't believe right I will just show you the set of characters which I have already drawn using PowerPoint uh, so, so these are all uh, something. Uh, 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 this is not actually downloaded from Google or something, right? So these are all different uh, uh, characters which I have drawn using uh, PowerPoint. Okay, and uh, how did I do that? I just used the following shapes, whatever uh, Microsoft actually has provided. Just using these shapes, I have drawn all these characters and uh, you will uh, see all uh, all those uh, tutorials uh, and uh, in fact it's going to be like detailed tutorial for uh, uh, for anyone to start doing it from the scratch okay so that will be in uh, the future videos so of course uh, uh, i would want you guys to subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss out uh, uh, such useful uh, videos uh, and you can use it in your uh, in your work, in your uh, day to day projects or uh, anything. Okay. So, in this uh, video specifically, I just want to get started with uh, the basics uh, basics of uh, drawing using PowerPoint. So, basics, uh, basic understanding for you to even uh, uh, get started with uh, uh, any character or any image drawing, right? Even if you want to draw a scenery, a picture, or something like that. So, what are the basics which you might have to understand? okay so so that is what i'm going to cover in this okay so this is the fundamental for you to uh, uh, listen to the future videos okay and uh, so i'll show you so these are the set of uh, shapes you normally see in any powerpoint right uh, so you go to this home tab you click this arrow down here and you see the bunch of uh, shapes here so there are uh, uh, multiple variants right like you see lines rectangles basic shapes uh, bla uh, block arrows and then equation shapes and the flow charts the stars and of course you you yourself can see all this uh, stuff okay uh, so there are a few advantages and uh, uh, disadvantages of uh, uh, these shapes okay so so if you look at this basic shapes and rectangles right so these are something which you will be able to alter its uh, uh, dimension and uh, the flow chart thing right so though you see all these shapes it will be too difficult for you to alter its dimension of course you can make it small or uh, big and uh, 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 you can drag it uh, sideways or you can drag it uh, upwards all those things can be done with the flow charts as such but that is not going to help you much so what we are going to do is mostly we are going to pick all these shapes what you see the basic shapes and then the rectangles and of course the lines out of these three sections we are going to do all the all the drawings like what you are going to see okay so when you see when when i say it cannot be altered right so i will just show you an example okay so i am going to uh, pick this uh, trapezium it's a trapezoid okay so i'll just draw it here and of course i will pick uh, a flow chart shape so this is the flow chart shape okay so the basic difference between these two shapes is like you see this yellow circle around here and here you don't see that so what is that uh, uh, yellow circle all about right so you can drag it to the right or to the left and uh, slightly alter its shape but you cannot do it here 
all you can do is like just make it small or large but i don't have the option to change the curvature of this shape whereas you can do it here and one more example when i talk about the curvature right so this is again from the basic shapes this uh, moon shape so i draw it here and i still have this yellow i still have the ability to change its curvature but that doesn't come with this flowcharts so you cannot uh, you can use it for any of your uh, computer flowchart or representation in ppt or in powerpoint basically but that is not going to help you much with drawing any characters okay so so that is that is the point i'm trying to make here so all we are going to use is mostly these three shapes so this is the recently used shapes so you can just ignore this tab so it is all about lines rectangles and basic shapes out of which you will be able to arrive at all these characters what i have shown okay and uh, so this is the fundamental for you to learn even before you get started on uh, painting or drawing using powerpoint so and one more thing is right like uh, uh, you can fill out all these shapes i guess like this is uh, this is something which everyone knows uh, but still i would, i would want to cover that out because like uh, uh, mostly people miss out uh, uh, these fundamentals and this is important for them to learn so you can fill out with any shapes and of course it comes up with an outline uh, color which can be chosen changed or even you can just make it invisible okay so similarly you can do it okay uh, for the other characters as such other shapes as such and if at all uh, you see that this uh, uh, this shape has to come on top of this then you just click this shape and right click and then just click bring to front so this comes to the front so why i am saying all these things is right like we are going to use these basic stuff a lot in uh, the future uh, uh, video tutorial for you to learn so so and of course there are other uh, uh, features as such like bringing in uh, shadow effect or reflection effect and glow glossy and all those things can be done um, okay but uh, uh, the for the shadow effect right so maybe i might want to do a separate uh, tutorial for you to explain uh, how you can bring in a real life uh, shadow effect on these objects okay so so these are the basic guys and uh, uh, so as i mentioned right just uh, please subscribe to my channel and also click the bell icon so that uh, uh, you don't miss out uh, the tutorials uh, uh, of uh, uh, of showing like how we can draw these characters and lot many other uh, uh, interesting uh, 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 pictures. Uh, the, it's like a real uh, life uh, painting what you see, right? So which can be done using the PowerPoint. So so thanks for watching and uh, please wait for uh, uh, the other videos which I am going to upload. Thank you.